Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are making their way towards an official engagement. The couple, who E! News confirmed to be an item last fall, recently made their first official joint appearance together at the 2017 Invictus Games in Toronto last week. The couple also showed PDA at the event's closing ceremony Saturday, which were also attended by Markle's mother, Doria Radlin. But this isn't the first time Prince Harry has met his girlfriend's mom. This week wasn't the first time that Harry met Doria, says a close source. They actually met late last year so they're very close now. Doria sees Harry as one of the family, and he sees her like family too. Harry is, has become close with all of Meghan's closest friends Marcus Anderson, the Mulroneys, these are people who have welcomed him with warm and open arms and has really felt the love and protection. Carwhite Tangwear Image The Insider continues, when Meghan and Harry first began dating everyone did their best to help keep it a secret. The people Harry is surrounding himself with have already earned their trust. The source also says that Harry, Meghan, Doria had dinner at Jessica and Ben Mulroney's house on Thursday evening last week. With Ben and Jessica they all became friends very early on, the insider says. When Harry first started going to Toronto to visit Meghan, it was Ben and Jessica who had them over at their house for dinners, because it wasn't easy for them to go out in public without the risk of getting spotted. Harry's become close with their children Brian, John, and Ivy. Ivy especially is a big fan. She, of course, has no idea that Hess a prince, though Hess just Auntie Meghan's special friend Harry, who sometimes comes over with fund presents Danny Lasanto wire, and it sounds like Harry had a great time with everyone in Toronto this past week. Toronto was an amazing experience for Harry, a source close to Harry says. Everything to do with Invictus went according to plan and without hiccups. An uplifting and positive week spent doing what he loves most surrounded by good friends and the most important woman in his life. The source continues, while it was always discussed prior that Meghan would attend the games in some capacity, how it was going to play out was very much left for feeling out at the time. The day Harry walked through the village to wheelchair tennis in front of the photographers was pretty much spur of the moment. He was just in a great mood, and they kind of looked at each other before like, shall we just get this over with in a way they wish they didn't leave it for so long, because after that initial moment was gone, it suddenly felt very easy to be out there as a couple with people looking at them, photos being taken, etc. And close pals are already planning their wedding outfits Harry left Toronto yesterday on a high, and can't wait to see Meghan next another source reveals. She has a packed schedule between now and November with suits, but after that will be an exciting time for them and a new chapter in their relationship. The insider adds, while Meghan may not be wearing a ringer of formal engagement announced, it's fair to say they're as good as engaged now. They've spoken about their marriage plans openly with each other, and friends and family around them are pretty much thinking about wedding attire already.